Good morning. We are working on automatic door lock unlock system in which we will show both simulation and emulation. These are the group members working on the project. This is the timeline chart for our project. For review 1, we will be giving the layout followed by the implementation plan. For review 2, we will be submitting the Proteus simulation after which we will go on developing our prototype. By mid-April, we will be completing our project. The hardware and software requirements are listed below. Mainly, we will be using AT89C51 microcontroller, 8051 programming board, LCD, keypad and servo motor. Uh, software, in software, we will be using Keel compiler and Proteus. The block diagram of our project is as follows. This is how the project will be implemented. The LCD will initially display enter password. The user has to enter the five digit password which will be masked by an asterisk symbol so that no one else can read the password while he types it. If the password matches the one that has already been programmed, the system will open the door by rotating the servo motor. The status of the door will then be displayed on the LCD as open. If the password does not match, incorrect will be displayed on the LCD. This is how the keypad will be interfaced with the microcontroller. We plan to use either row or column scanning. In this, when a particular key has been pressed, the terminals connected to the key will get shorted. And for example, if R1 is set to low and C4 is also found to be low, then you can identify the key being pressed as S4. Next, we have to interface the servo motor with the microcontroller. If the password that we have entered is a perfect match, the microcontroller pin connected to the base of the transistor will turn high. This will provide sufficient current to the relay which will cause the 5 volt servo motor to rotate. Now here, the mechanism is as follows. The motor is connected to the end of a linear gear. When the motor rotates in one direction, that is when the password is cor correct, the gear moves in a particular direction which will unlock the door. Now, when the button on a keypad is pressed, that is a reset button, the motor will rotate in the opposite direction which will cause the system to lock. That is the servo motor, that is the gear will move in the opposite direction. The division of work is not hardlined in our project. All the four members will be giving their inputs in all areas. The work division of our project is as follows. Shreesh and Shruti start off with LCD and keypad interfacing where all of us will be giving our inputs. Debrupa and Minalni take off from Proteus simulation and will focus on developing the prototype. The limitations of our project is as follows. It is a low range circuit, that is, the keypad needs to be kept attached to the door. Second, also this project aims at a basic prototype where reset mechanism is not applicable. We have used the following references for our project. Thank you.